So maybe you're using Vokey to do some podcasting on your Edit Me Classroom website. Maybe you've even got your students involved. You see here on my site, I have a student podcast. I have them create it and then I put it on here because as you've probably learned, students cannot add JavaScript to their Edit Me sites. Only administrators can. This quick tip video is going to show you how to let a student create his or her own Vokey and put it on his or her site without your help. So I am on a student site. Okay, so I've created this student site and I'm, you see here I've got my access private website page and I come into my private web page and it's got a lot of different stuff on it. Let's say I want to add a Vokey podcast. So let's go to Vokey. Now this is my Vokey page, but we can assume that a student did this. So they are in here and they've created this cool looking Vokey and put their sound to it and they're ready to go. Down here you've got your embed information. Click here. Normally what you probably do as the site administrator if you're creating Vokeys is you click other. And when you click other you'll get a code that, when you click that you'll see, is uh, a code that you can put on as an administrator but a student cannot. It will not accept this code. Here's the way around this. When your students create their Vokey, teach them when they get to this part, when they click on this embed in, scroll down and click on WordPress. Of course you can change the size to um, different dimensions uh, starting here or going up to the bigger size or you can customize it click get code and now you're gonna go ahead and click that and it'll highlight it and you copy that and close it now send them back to their websites on edit me so they're gonna come into edit mode just like this and let's say I want to put this on the bottom because it's easier to put it at the top or the bottom and I am going to create a little space and I'm gonna click text editor and then I'm gonna come all the way down and I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna paste that code right there and I'll click back to rich text editor And when I come down here that looks good for me I'm gonna go ahead and click save and close and when I do that you'll see at the bottom there is my Vokey on my student page and you can play that and that's gonna work now remember the key is for your embed code click the drop down menu and choose WordPress the WordPress code can be embedded by a student on his or her site in edit me just um, get the WordPress code and make sure also when they are editing that you tell them to click on the text editor and that's it uh, that is uh, how you get a Vokey podcast onto a student site as a student Okay, have fun with Vokey. Your students are going to love it.